Homeopathy is a strange system of alternative medicine that revolves around diluting chemicals again and again until there's nothing left but but water. Nonetheless, thousands of patients swear by homeopathic remedies, with sales in the United States alone reaching six billion dollars for water. It, it, it's just water. Even they say it's just water. There's no medicine in it at all, according to anybody. They're not even, they're not even trying. It's not even junk science, it's just water. It's just, it's just water. Homeopathy is anchored in the archaic 18th century belief that like cures like. Following this logic, poison ivy is cured by drinking water mixed with a very small amount of poison ivy, and snake bites can be cured with dilute snake venom. Believe it or not, those remedies actually exist. Homeopaths, who by the way rarely have any medical training, dilute these chemicals in a lot of water. In fact, many homeopathic tinctures are marked 30C, which means one part chemical for every 10 to the 30 power parts water. That's less than one drop of medicine in a fish tank, less than one drop in a swimming pool, less than a drop in a lake or in the ocean. To get one molecule of medicine, you'd have to drink every atom in the entire solar system. But homeopaths claim the water somehow remembers the chemical anyway because they vigorously shake it. Out of thousands of studies that have shown that homeopathy is bogus, practitioners like to cherry pick rare successful trials as proof that their water solutions, which defy the laws of physics and curiously line their pockets, are scientifically effective. Here's why that doesn't make much sense. The vast majority of medical studies have what's called a 95% confidence interval. It means that scientists are 95% sure that a treatment works and that they recognize there's a 5% chance of a random result. When you think about it, that means about one in every 20 studies of the exact same subject are expected to show an effect even if there isn't one. That is, if you run 20 similar studies on whether carrots or river dancing or water cure cancer, you'd fully expect at least one of them to randomly show positive results. Homeopathic remedies occasionally make people feel better, either because of the placebo effect, or because their doctors spend more time with them, or because they're also taking Tylenol on the slide. But one thing is for sure, if anyone tells you that water can be shaken into remembering a chemical in a solution so dilute that everything we know about physics and chemistry suggests it's not even there, that's junk science.